It's 9am and like every morning it's time for the daily team meeting of the Amoka Ocean Masters New York to Barcelona race. Everyone present and correct? Let us begin. Given that around the table are people from Spain, England and France, it is the English language that prevails. I don't know if you want to talk through this, but what was happened over the following days? Jacques Carrez, the race director, explains what has happened during the night, the options for the different competitors and the weather forecast for the coming days. Those who ask the questions are the international journalists James Boyd, Christophe Favreau and Carlos Peak. They are the ones who will ask the questions to the skippers during the radio vacation. They then write the daily press releases. Beside them sits Leslie Greenhouge, Director of Communications and Marketing, and her Open Sports Management colleague, Marion Cardon. The group agrees on the day's issues and topics to be addressed in the radio vacation, which will then appear in the press releases, social media and videos. Jeremy Troughton, the Logistics Manager of the race, is here. Also, Santi Serra, Editorial Director of the Foundation for Oceanic Navigation of Barcelona, co-organiser of the event. It's a true team effort. The meeting is over, everybody goes back to work. Back to the race. Some of the options chosen on Saturday to cross the dying front have proved better than others. Geis, you remember, the boat which took the most northern route, has lost a lot. <laughs> Fortunately, they had not seen the video footage sent by Neutrogena earlier. Here is what the situation looked like ahead of them. Saffron had chosen to pass west of the Azores and then continue 50 miles north before jibing east, directly ahead of Geis. She now leads Geis by 125 miles. Behind, Hugo Boss has recovered second place and is back ahead of Neutrogena. They have chosen the same option as Safran to the west of the Azores. However, thankfully, after a complicated weekend, the fleet can finally enjoy some nice downwind sailing for the next few days. Join us again tomorrow.